That is yin arm. That's not so yin anymore. Now it's more like huang huang ar. Yes. Or hom ar. Because I soak it with the. Because we soaked it with the red lotus seed. Yeah. Seen below. Okay. That's why. Okay. We're getting ready to rock and roll here. Me. I'm in the way. All right. What do we got here? So today we're making silver mushroom drink. It's kind of like a dessert. Silver mushroom. Right. Or here you might see it known as a snow fungus or snow mushroom or uh -huh. stuff. Um, you know, different names, but same stuff. And this is when it's dry. Just want to show you. So this is when it's mm -hmm, dry. Mm -hmm. This one is yellow because I soak it with the red lotus. It turns yellow, but in general, that's the color. And it smells a little bit like that mushroom fungus smell really good. Pretty so light though. Pretty light. Very light. So you don't mm. have a strong smell. Um, and soak that overnight. I like to put I like to put some uh, lotus seeds uh, here. It's very delicious. And uh, I'm also gonna put in baiguo, which is kinko, king, ginkgo, 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 ginkgo seeds. seeds. Uh, something that is a yinxing, right? Yinxing, yeah, it's mm. very good. So very all delicious, all healthy. Mm. Uh, recipe size. Doesn't matter much, uh, you know, in terms of how much you put. I usually so you just, can eyeball it. Is that what you mean? Yeah, I soak the whole thing and I put it in a big pot, and, and then you tear it apart viciously. Like viciously, this is a stress relief recipe one hundred and one. Right, get rid of those. Not get rid of. I detach don't like them from the, the like butt. the root, the butt kind it's of. It's a little thing. tougher, I suspect, right? Yeah, or a lot it's tougher. Not quite delicious. Today's stove looks quite clean. Really. <laughs> <laughs> you want some scissors? Nah. I'm okay. So something like that. It's you can go. Ying are with a haircut now. Yeah, and <laughs> now it's a buzz cut number two. So. You can go a little bit more. I'm just not gonna linger too much on that, and uh, break them into small pieces. Basically, like bite size or spoon bite size. Spoon size. Spoon size. Yeah. These are slippery, so if they're too big for a yes. spoon, they will slide off, and you will be frustrated. Trust yes. me, I've been there. <laughs> yeah. Throw this in. Throw the seeds. You can buy white ones or red ones. I found red ones taste better. I like those, but they're <laughs> one good. of them did Germany. Right there, they They're, have the heart. This heart, don't worry if you taste it. The heart is a bitter. It's really good, uh, functional wise. Slightly healthy, bitter. right? With a little bitter. Yeah, and put in the. Oh, this one I'm not gonna put in right now. I'm gonna when it's almost ready. Put this only needs three to five minutes to. Right. So I won't put that right now. Okay. Now is the most. I think one of the most thing is this water. This is the key ingredient. Okay, uh, this oh, ignore this. We here. have the Wakefield. So this is not PC water. No, this is the Wakefield water. So important things to use either tap water or spring water is the best. You need to have a mineral in it. Mm. I mm. use because this soup when it's finished. Soup desserts finish is supposed to be quite slimy and a thick. It has a thick texture. Yeah, yes. slimy isn't really a delicious okay. word, but it, it does. Ha no, but it, it, I don't, it's a pretty accurate way to describe it. But it is delicious, even though it's um, a little bit slimy or a viscous. Let's say it's viscous. Right. And uh, and a slippery liquid. I once tested though. I once used the Brita water to boil that. No matter, I tried all the brand I could get here, and everyone comes out crispy. And uh, there's still water is water, mushroom is mushroom. I couldn't right. figure out why till once I the water doesn't thicken up, right? Yeah, because it's empty. Once I used mm. the tap water, I realized even the same brand, the same bag, the mushroom become better. Like. More uh, thicker. Oh, so you tried a bunch of different ying art. I thought it was the quality right. of the, the mushroom. mushroom because uh, sometimes it's hard to get. Eventually, I realized it's the water, it's the water. I'm using. Mm. So be sure to use like spring waters or at least tap waters, so you will turn. So don't use a highly filtered water. No, no distilled water. Yes, gotcha. perfect, perfect summarize. And 
Now I just uh, let it bring to a boil. Once mm -hmm. it's boiled, I'm gonna turn it down to simmer. So now it's uh, now it's a full boil. I'm just rolling boil. Turn it down to mini boil. I need to see a little bubbles, so not quite just peas. So I put that on medium low. Depends on your burner, and let it simmer for um... three days. <laughs> just kidding. Just kidding. For how long? I'm not quite sure. So. I'll let you know how long I let this because different brands of silver mushroom they could be different. The criteria is the soup, the, and the, the viscous soup, right? Yes, and the softness the of the silver mushroom. So right. I'll show you when it's done. Cool. Ta da! Da 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 da! <laughs> Sorry, a little Daft Punk. So I think this is actually quite ready. Uh, that was like uh, forty minutes. So, 40? Yeah. Four zero minutes, folks. Yeah. Not too long. So look at the texture. And once yeah, it cools, it it'll thicken up even more. Thicken right? up even more. But so I red. To, it's pretty. Yeah. It's the, the, the lotus seed. Now I'm going to put in the... The, the ying are the ginkgo seed. Ginkgo. Ginkgo. Ginkgo seed or ginkgo nuts. Ginkgo nuts. Yeah. These are nuts. They have a shell, huh? Just like us. Or nuts. <laughs> <laughs> wow, what a weird love sound. And I'm gonna put some date. Oh, these are so yes. good. Juju dates, right? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Here they come. Big Ziploc so. coming over. Mm. There they are off in the distance. You see them up there? I'm gonna look up. Mm -hmm. There they are. So they Um, I usually give them an open because they have a shell. They skin. have a skin. skin. So you give Sorry. them a crack so the juice can get right in. Mm -hmm. Just, I don't know if you can see, she just give that a twist. Boom, open. Good enough. You can cut or some don't, fancier don't way. Don't worry, don't worry. Just crack them. Okay. Okay. Mm, this really will make good. the whole drink even darker. Mm-hmm. And sweeter. And sweeter, right. If you, uh, we will sweeten this because I have some rose jam. I'm going to use <gasps> that. Yes, you can hear that feel really love I the love rose jam. Rose jam. <laughs> uh, if you don't have those, uh, be, the more traditional way is we use the rock sugar to sweeten that to your level. But I'm just... <laughs> oh, I'm oh just, sorry. I was supposed to be my inside Close voice. the lid and let it simmer for five minutes and then I'm going to turn it off. So it's been uh, five minutes, Ooh. ten minutes. Five to ten minutes. Oh, seven minutes based on the clock here. <laughs> uh, I think that's pretty oh. much done. The date hasn't changed much. Don't worry. Uh, will sit here for a while tomorrow they will look very delicious yeah they'll marinate yeah and mm. i'll turn it off it's a little bit too late and we're not gonna stay up very late so what i'm gonna do is just to close the lid and tomorrow morning we will have that with breakfast good night it's past our bedtime it's morning we didn't want microphones so you can only hear me well look at that date I'm telling you, the dates are so good. Too big. Go there. You go there. You don't. Here comes the rose jam, okay? Oh boy. I don't smell it yet. It's gonna it's gonna hit soon though, because that, that ying are is hot. Oh boy, that looks so good. I'm trying to get walk the smell over here. Oh boy. It's burnt. 